So, Lucy, is it? I see you worked as the administrative secretary at a dental practice for seven years. But do you think you're ready for the high octane world of our school's front office? Well, I can answer phones and make copies and I'm your sister, so give me the stupid job. Well, let's keep this professional. Next question. You going to mom's for Thanksgiving? <laughs> Seriously, that's that's your question? Please, I hate it when you're not there. She's mean and critical and puts reasons in the end. Okay, so clearly working for you will be complicated, but this means free tuition for my kids. This place has computers and sports and theater and not one metal detector in sight. It also has the best work of all, me. And my constant support and guidance to help undo all your poor life decisions. Don't make me punch you at my job interview, Andre. I'm just saying, I told you not to marry a roadie and you wouldn't listen. You were a college nerd, I was just 17. And he had a Corvette and an ass like Brick Springfield. I had no choice. Ugh. How is Keg anyway? Keg is Keg. The last I heard he was touring with the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Oh, they're good. The one guy plays bass with a sock on his wiener. Uh, flea. Yeah, I think Keg handles the socks. <laughs> hmm. You got the job. Welcome to William Penn Academy. Thank you. Uh, seriously, this is a lifesaver. The kids are gonna be freaking thrilled. What's wrong? Nothing. Nothing? What do you mean, nothing? What is wrong with you? Are you a kid who needs charts to learn feelings? Stop covering for me! Stand up for yourself, Beth! That's enough, Mavis, you're drunk. <laughs> I've been drunk the whole time I've been back and no one gave two shits until this one got bent out of shape. <laughs> Why did you invite me? I didn't invite you, Beth did. Beth practically forced me to call you. I mean, she even stood there and supervised to make sure I'd do it. She feels sorry for you. We all do. It's obvious you've been having some mental sickness, some depression, and you're very lonely and you're confused. So Beth made me invite you even though I knew it would be a mistake. I knew it. You're lying. He's not. What about now? Do you hate me now? Because I hate you. So it should be easy. What is wrong with all of you people? Mavis, honey. I came back for you. For you. And I hate this town. It's a stupid hick lake town that smells like fish shit. So I just wanted you to know that. <laughs>